South Africa has been plagued by hundreds of service delivery protests every week, with citizens complaining about lack of water, sanitation, and low quality education. We investigate the other side of the coin and ask the question, could there be obstacles that prevent ministers from delivering essential services? I am Bunny Leven, the celebrated TV journalist known for the almost award-winning documentary Five to No Rhino, here to give you the real scoop. Our investigation continues and we speak to the DG of Energy and Minerals in one of the most underperforming provinces in the country. Could they be facing the same problems? Uh, thank you very much, Ms. Uh, uh, you know, we are often criticized uh, for being lazy and incompetent. But uh, the conditions under which we work, uh, I never analyzed and they never criticized. Could you tell us a little bit more about these conditions? Of course, I would love to. Uh, for instance, um, you know, we had a, we had a meeting, uh, we had a very important agenda to table, and there was no table. How could you table something with no table? You know, it's like chairing a meeting with no chair. It's almost impossible. We had to retrench our chairman because there were no chairs. It's difficult, it's impossible, you know. And, you know, uh, say for instance, with these budget cuts, uh, our last meeting, my whole presentation was printed in black and white. Uh, and, and, and how does that affect proceedings? Well, the thing is, you see, um, I had the beautiful flag of our country, I had some beautiful pie charts, but they were all in black and white. I didn't know what, kind, I didn't know what was going on. You know, and it's impossible. I dare Helen Zeal to work on these conditions. It's impossible. Well, there you have it. It seems the printer is getting in the way of service delivery. Could it get any more ridiculous? Our investigation continues. So, what are some of the challenges do you face in your job on a daily basis? Well, we often encounter hurdles which are unthinkable. At times we go to work with the intention to do our jobs, but the working conditions are unbearable. We are expected to deliver services, but nobody has catered to our basic needs. What are these needs? We had a very, very important meeting last week where we were discussing a very important issue of an unfinished school in the Eastern Cape. Firstly, I was expected to fly there in economy class. Can you believe that? They picked us up at the airport in a yard and said, have you seen my cabs? We get to the meeting, there are no muffins. How dare you expect us to start a meeting with no muffins? Are these things actually preventing you from doing your job? Of course. Can you believe that? We're here with the DG for Science and Technology to find out what her challenges are. My main challenge right now is that the feng shui of this place is really unbalanced, you know? Yeah. Now, what does that mean? Well, I'm glad you asked. This corner right here, you know, it like traps all of our energy. And I don't know like how to get out of that space. It's like it's shackling me. But that's me. Oh, out. News that moves. ENCA.com